Todd Kressley confirms Nanny Faye's devastating cancer diagnosis. Hello everyone, my name is Alana B. Welcome back to my another video. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a like up. News has started to make rounds on social media that Todd Chrisley's mother Nanny Faye was diagnosed with bladder cancer. The posts are coming from all different profiles on Facebook, and it appeared to be a sketchy copy and pasted message. So Chrisley knows best fans weren't sure whether there was any truth to this information. Did Nanny Faye Chrisley get diagnosed with bladder cancer? Here's what we know. News of Nanny Faye Chrisley's Bladder Cancer Circles Facebook About an hour ago, the same message started popping up all over Facebook. The message came attached to a photo of Nanny Faye, from the Chrisley family, for everyone who loves our sweet Nanny Faye. It has been confirmed by the family that she has bladder cancer. They are going through some really trying times and would appreciate your prayers. Love and support poured into the comments of these posts across Facebook, but it was unclear where this news came from. None of these posts were made by anyone in the Chrisley family so some fans were a bit skeptical. Moreover, some fans just hoped it was a hoax because the family has enough going on and fans want Nanny Faye to live forever. Where did this come from? Doing a bit more digging, TV Shouses was able to find a comment by a fan noting that the family did confirm Nanny Faye was diagnosed with bladder cancer. The individual added Todd and Julie confirmed this information on a recent episode of Chrisley Confessions. On episode 187, which dropped yesterday, Todd confirms his mother was diagnosed with bladder cancer and is currently going through treatment. Todd clarifies this is not something that happened recently. Turns out, Nanny Faye was diagnosed with bladder cancer last fall. She, however, didn't want the world to know this information. So she asked for it to be kept under wraps. Todd Chrysler explains that news of her bladder cancer came out during the court trial, and he realized it was beginning to make rounds. Likewise, photographers and reporters lurked at his mother's house, hoping to get a photo or a story. Todd Chrysler tells his listeners that Nanny Faye has been receiving weekly treatments for a while. He prays that God will keep a healing hand on Nanny Faye, and he asks his listeners and fans to respect that Nanny Faye is 77 years old and currently fighting for her life. Are you shocked to learn the news circulating that Nanny Faye Chrisley has bladder cancer is true? Share your thoughts in the comments, and keep coming back for the latest Chrisley news. Todd and Julie Chrisley currently on house arrest. As those following Todd and Julie Chrisley right now know, the couple is currently on house arrest after being found guilty of bank fraud and tax evasion. Their legal team is already hard at work appealing the verdict, but Todd and Julie are under house arrest in the meantime. As TV Shouses previously reported, Savannah Chrisley was also spotted dropping by to visit her father but there haven't been reports of Chase or Nanny Faye dropping by just yet. While the couple plans to appeal the verdict, their sentencing hearing is currently slated for October. As far as Chrisley knows best fans know, Nick Curdiles and Savannah Chrisley are no longer together. Savannah seemingly confirmed these rumors when she took a vacation recently with her friends and her brother Chase. Emmy Metters tagged along on the trip, and fans assume that Nick would have tagged along if he and Savannah were still together. Todd Chrisley, however, has been very open when it comes to his feelings for Nick Curdiles. On his podcast, he made it clear that Nick would be a member of his family regardless of his relationship status with Savannah. Todd even joked that things may get awkward around the holidays if Savannah dates someone else as Nick will also be sitting at the dinner table. A lot of fans think Nick Curdiles got lucky by getting away from Savannah, as they just don't think she's good enough for him. There, however, are just as many fans who continue to root for this couple and hope things will work out. Naturally, there are also fans who don't care for Nick and believe he just wants in on the Chrisley money. 
Do you think it is sweet that Nate Curdiles came to visit Todd during his house arrest? Let us know your thoughts in the comments down below. And keep coming back for more on Chris Lee Knows Best. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel, America Trends 24, and stay with us.